What is going on, guys? Ah, man. This is a long time coming. This is a very long time coming. Classroom of the Elite Season 2. Apologies for being so fashionably late, but get used to it because of my work schedule. Even if I was doing my old job, I would still be doing these very late because I usually work mornings. This comes out at 6 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. I go into work at 4 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. So by the time this episode comes out, I've only been at work a quarter of my shift. So it takes me about a half an hour to get home and all that jazz. So going forward, Classroom of the Elite will be late in terms of today's reactions uh, on, on the days up. So, I recently rewatched this with my old roommate who re who moved out a few months ago, and we thought it was great. I remember how much I enjoyed it. In fact, you can actually watch my old reactions to Classroom of the Elite. It was the first year I actually was doing reactions, so it's been quite a while. What four years almost? Um, what happened to me? <laughs> but. The one problem I had with the series throughout the entirety of it was it's a cliffhanger ending. I didn't do well, um, apparently, in sales with the Blu-rays. And a lot of the light novel readers did not like it because apparently they changed some of the things that happen with some of the characters. And Ayuno Koji is not as dead inside or uh, un completely lack of emotion. Uh, he at least has some things in the light novel, but again, not read the light novel. I do know a little bit what happens, because I accidentally found out some things, but I'll keep that to myself. But yeah, I thoroughly enjoyed it. I thought the first season was good, first season was good, but I couldn't recommend it to anyone because it left off on such a cliffhanger. Uh, if you don't know, um, the last part was the island arc, where Class D was able to uh, Scooby-Doo and... Uno reverse card a lot of things, and then they ended up winning, and then that's kind of how it ended. Um, I believe that's how it ends, as it, it shows them, like, at the end, they flipped it around with some of that big, elaborate plan. So it was very interesting. Uh, it was very good, and I thoroughly enjoyed it. Now, going forward, I'd just like to say, please forgive me with the names again it has been quite a minute since i've watched it i'd say about probably like half a year ago at least um when me and my old roommate had watched this so names are gonna be hard the only thing i really remember was uh, ayano koji because that is a very unique name um but um i'm going to remember a lot of their names once i see i'm like up oh, that's right um like the black haired girl i think it starts with an h or a k it's one of the two I'm probably totally wrong. But yeah, enough rambling. I'm ready to jump into this, so without further ado, let's jump in to episode one of the second season of Classroom of the Elite. Never thought I'd say this, but starting three, two, one, let's jam. Alright. Remember to keep a clear head in difficult times. Aquiam. Um, oh, sorry, Helen. Aquiam Momentum. Fuck. <laughs> Hopefully I have this set fine. Oh, hold on. I need to make sure that you guys can't hear that. Sorry. And then, yeah. Horikita. And the class... The, right, the class... President? Student council president? It's kind of a dick. Oh, and then his big speech at the end. I don't care for anyone. I used you all. Intro? I, I heard that this way I posted. I decided not to watch it because I want to watch this. Okay. 
Really quickly, I'm just going to change something real quick. Sorry, I just want to make it a little bit harder to see, just in case. Kushida? Oh, yeah, Kushida. Episode, what, two? Oh. That's a shot. I have, okay, so is he going to be the main baddie this season? He had hardly any time. This is a good opening. I don't know if I like it as much as the first one. But the first one is a fucking slapper. Of course. Of course. <laughs> I remember that dude. I kind of wish they made their names a little bit easier to read, but no one heard no. Hmm. Never been to Tapanyaki. It's cool though. <laughs> Again? Right now? Oh shit. Damn. May you receive a penalty? Never ends. Oh, okay. I don't remember some of these guys. This is gonna be the long haired dude. No. Oh! Interesting. I was wondering why there was only such a select.
Interesting. I was wondering, I was like, this seems like a win-win on case one. So there's got to be a deduction. Oh, that person will also lose 500. Oh. Oh, so the VIP can purpose it like. Interesting. This is going to be an interesting. I'll stay. Yeah. I still can't believe that guy's in high school. Apologies, like, I'm not, like, being super reactive. This reminds me a lot of the first time I watched Kakagurui, where I'm being very, um, very crazy. And I had to pay attention. Class C? Of course. You're also not in high school. <laughs> Yeah. 
You'd probably lose. Nice. Just like her, yeah. From the small snippets we saw of her last season, yeah, that makes the most amount of sense. Especially out of all of them. Now, she could be a master manipulator just through the way she talks and her attitude, but who knows. With how crazy the show is with its twists, it wouldn't su be surprising if she was actually like that. She's been looking at her phone for a while. Is she the VIP? Never say that again. So all of Class A is not even going to participate? At least with them. Again, apologies, I'm just like really focusing on everything that's going on.
Hmm. Hmm. It's an interesting point. She's still looking at her phone. There's got to be something that she's looking up on her phone. Unless I'm overthinking it. That could also be it. Those look like text messages. She's the VIP. Some yeah, there's something. I think she's the VIP. Doesn't want her picture taken. Hmm. Something's going on with her. Unless she's really focused on a gotcha game, and then in which case I understand. I know Koji doing what he did his best. Now she's shopping. But, like, it's like she's just like. It, it, mm, I don't know! Shower scene. But. I wonder if she's going to... Aww. I had to double look at the time. I had to double check the time. 
there's something going on. Why is she constantly looking at her phone, trying to, like, not be super involved? I don't know. There's a lot to unpack, I feel like. Ow. Very interesting pose. She really is going to play a giant part. She's going to play a huge part in this series. In this season, at least. So I know a little bit of what happens in the light novel. Forewarning, I will tell you what that is. So, really quickly, if you don't want spoilers, I recommend... Just wrapping it up here and saying thanks for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Let me know what you guys thought in the comment section below. And I will see you later. But for those who want to hear the spoilers, here we go. So I know that these two get together. Um, because I think what we were saying was like, oh, um, this was actually back when we I was doing my rewatch with my roommate. And we were looking, I was like, oh, I wonder what happens a little bit like later on with XYZ. And then I was like, oh, you know... Main character probably ends up with uh, um, the the girl, the black haired girl, and then no, they start dating after a while. So I wonder if we're gonna start getting this romance start in this one. Like I don't know the details of why they started dating, so I'm gonna that's gonna be new for me. But I do know that they eventually end up dating. Although granted, they could change the light novel from they, they can deviate from the light novel, so who knows? But that's what I know, and that's all I know. Really? That I can remember? Right? Yeah. But, I'm gonna wrap up this video. Let me know what you guys thought. I It's great to see this. I think this is gonna be a very interesting, like, little, um, game that's going on. This special test. But yeah, I, it's gl I'm really glad to see Classroom of the Elite come back. It took a while. But, it's better late than never, I guess you could say. Um, I did say that I was eventually going to release my what I'm going to be watching for summer, and I still plan on doing that. I've been very busy lately. Um, maybe tomorrow, since I actually had the day off. But, yeah, anyways, guys, happy 4th of July for all my American friends out there and viewers. And, as always, have a good day, and I will see you guys next time for whatever video I'm going to be watching. I need to look at the schedule again. But, anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.